In the United Kingdom, troubles are mounting for Prime Minister Rishi Sunak over a tax evasion row around the Conservative Party chief, Nadeem Zahavi. Experts have suggested that there is a concerted effort to target Sunak himself beyond his Tory colleagues. At Prime Minister's questions in Parliament, Rishi Sunak said no issues were raised with him when he appointed his Conservative Party's chairman, Nadeem Zahavi. He also refused opposition's demands to fire Zahavi. Sunak has ordered an independent probe by his ethics advisor into Nadeem Zahavi's alleged tax evasions. He has said that there are questions that need answering. Earlier, the Labour Party had challenged the British Prime Minister on why he did not find out details of his minister's £5 million tax dispute earlier. The opposition leader, Keir Starmer, accused uh, Sunak of extending former Prime Minister Boris Johnson's dismal record of scandal instead of helping the people of Britain. The opposition parties have raised questions about Zahavi's tax payments. The alleged tax evasion relates to Zahavi's controversial multi-million pound shareholding in the polling company YouGov. Zahavi has come under fire over claims that he tried to avoid paying taxes. He claims he paid taxes, which he owed, and a 30% penalty as well, with the total settlement amounting to $5.2 million. Now, the image of Prime Minister Rishi Sunak in the Conservative Party is clearly at stake. The ongoing unrest in the United Kingdom, in which key public and private sector services are on strike over pay, and the growing call from opposition and British public over the deteriorating condition of the state-run National Health Service, or NHS, has drawn massive criticism against Rishi Sunak and his government. While taking over 10 Downing Street last year, Rishi Sunak had given an assurance that responsibility to restore integrity and professionals after the scandals under Boris Johnson and the economic chaos under Liz Truss would be his government's top priority. But scandals like this continue to cast a cloud over a big gap between what Rishi Sunak promised and what is currently playing out in Britain.